Hi, I'm Nelson Coates, and I'm here at the 2024 Festival of Arts Reuse Recycle Fashion Show. It's open to all exhibitors here at the festival, and they're encouraged to find materials that have never been used in a piece of clothing. Reuse, recycle, recreate, come up with something really new. And today, we have some guest judges, all amazingly talented artists in their own right, and there's four different categories. Most red carpet worthy, and most creative use of materials, most innovative, and there's a People's Choice Award. And all of these have a cash prize attached to them. So it kind of encourages the artist to really try and think outside of the box. My name is Diane Chalice Davy. I'm director of Pageant of the Masters. And we are here today in beautiful Laguna Beach on the festival grounds. And you are going to see a recycle fashion show. But in addition to that, you have some lovely outfits designed by our scenic artist, Bradley Ellsbury and from the pageant. Now our pageant theme this year, you probably know, is a la mode, the art of fashion. So we have three gowns from our show here today. I'm Brad Ellsbury, and I'm an artist from the festival and a designer. And for the first 10 years of this show, I did recycled costumes. And this year I'm honored, been asked to do a retrospective of some of the pieces that I still have. So they'll be coming on after the models do the original show and showing off things that are made of denim and paint and plastic paper and I hope it'll be a treat for the audience. The audience has always been really kind to me and really enjoyed the stuff that, that has come out of this show. Hi, I'm Elizabeth McGee and I'm an oil painter but every year I love doing the recycled fashion show because it's totally out of my normal wheelhouse so this year I saved a bunch of socks because they weren't bad, but they weren't comfortable. So I thought I could use these. So even the flowers of the dress are socks, the corsage, and it's just all of my old socks. Oh, yeah. Hi, I'm Cody Nicely and I'm a glass artist. I do hand-blown, hot sculpted uh, aquatic sculpture. And we have put McKenna Michaels here in a mermaid suit made out of recycled and recovered materials. We've got zip ties up top with recycled glass that we've painted. We have recovered recycled bowls, some of my hand-blown glass on top, and then these are all hand-cut alcohol-dyed CDs. And then if you turn around, McKenna, we've got a train in the back. We have a bunch of trash that we collected from Aliso Beach in one morning, and everything's hand-sewn on with a uh, fishing line. I'm Rowan Foley, and I do drawing here at the festival. This year I did a dress inspired by the Junihito, which is a traditional Japanese dress worn in the Heian period, and it's 12 layers. When I saw it, it reminded me of tissue paper, how delicate the silk is, because it's all about delicate layers, and so I was inspired by springtime and summertime. Hi, I'm Linda Petitke. I'm a goldsmith at the Festival of Arts and uh, made this outfit for the runway show. I wanted to keep the outfit light, so I made it out of fiberglass screen and some trim left over from an abandoned sewing project. Up here is some ribbon and feathers, and that's it. I'm Ann Moore. I'm one of the five printmakers at the Festival of Art this summer. I am a tea drinker and I had tons of tea bag covers and I thought of combining tea and art. So the jewelry is candy wrappers and a clutch, tea bag covers. The feature is the hat. I created the cup from mailing tube. I'm Nancy Swan. I go by NC Swan. It's how I sign my work. I had this idea to do a dress out of newspapers and I lightly painted them white. It gives me another creative outlet than my watercolors, which is what I do. Each panel is a different year with a different silhouette in a cameo of hand cut lace and they go from 1800 to 2020. <laughs> We're going to start off with the most creative concept. The winner is 
and more tea bags. Now for most exciting ensemble, Cody Nicely. Congratulations, most exciting ensemble, Cody Nicely. And now for most innovative use of materials, Elizabeth McGee for the innovative use of materials. And I have the honor of announcing the most glamorous and elegant red carpet worthy creation, Nancy Swan. And now for our final category, it's the People's Choice Awards, Nancy Swan. Let's give all these great artists a big round of applause. All the artists deserve applause, and I actually agreed with the winner. So it was a wonderful day, and I think I've been 10 times in 15 years. It was incredible, super fun. It's wonderful to be outdoors in the canyon. We love it here. I've come all the way from Australia to see it with my good friends, and it was everything I thought it would be. Very unique, totally worthwhile. I recommend it to everybody, come on down.